Hello and here are the latest global LGBTI news headlines from Pink 60. Today a London jury found Joel Orsay and his girlfriend Diana Christia guilty of the murder of Adrian Murphy. The pair poisoned the champion dancer with devil's breath, stealing thousands of pounds of goods after befriending him on Grindr. A sexual health clinic in Belfast has closed indefinitely despite being funded until next spring. The clinic closed six months ago due to Covid and never reopened, leaving 600 service users without PrEP. Pride in Protest has published an open letter requesting police and corrective services cease participation in Sydney's Gay and Lesbian Mardi Gras Parade. The letter is a response to concerns over historic and ongoing institutional brutality. PWR are holding a colourful protest at Cape Town's Seapoint Promenade on October 31st. Clouds of powder, paint and printed handouts will highlight bullying at the protest, which coincides with the city's 30th Pride anniversary. And finally, Happiest Season director Clea Duval is turning the high school memoirs of Tegan and Sarah into a comedy series for Amazon. Duval is writing and producing the pilot in association with Brad Pitt's Plan B. Well, that's all from us for today. Join us again next time for more of the latest LGBTI news headlines.